Hey smileys, hey. It's AI and this is AI Brown Smile. Welcome back to my channel and to my 2019 bullet journal flip through. I started out with a page to set intentions and goals for the year. My word of the year was action. This is what the layout for my monthly logs looks like. A calendar of the full month and then a section for goals and important dates. Here's my weekly log layout, which is consistent for each month as well. A space for each day of the week, a section for a to-do list, and a section for goals and notes. I used an affirmation for the header of each page. I think it's really important to self-affirm on a daily basis to keep yourself encouraged and keep away negative and self-sabotaging thoughts. You know we keep it positive over here, smileys. This is my habit tracker for January, which says creating healthy habits is a healthy habit. Here's January's gratitude log, which lists one thing that I'm grateful for, for each day of the month. As you can see, I use a lot of magazine clippings. If you watched my 2018 flip through, I did the same thing in that journal as well. Whatever images, words, or phrases speak to me, I use them. This is my February habit tracker, which looks a bit different than January. I actually used a landscape format, but I didn't like this one as much. I also tried a different layout for my March habit tracker and it was a bit much. I sectioned my habits into monthly, weekly, and daily habits. I do like to try different layouts until I find the one I like most, but this was not it. April 2019, the month my husband and I said I do. Here is April's habit tracker. For this one, I listed the habits and then one through 30 for each day of the month. It's pretty to look at, but it took more time than some of the other layouts. I've been using a bullet journal for about four years now, and I don't think I'll ever use a traditional planner again. A bullet journal can be whatever you want it to be, a calendar, an intentional goal planner, a habit tracker, a gratitude journal, vision board, a place for notes, all in one. And that's what I love about it. Okay, maybe I have a small girl crush on Naomi Campbell, so what? Oh, and I just love this page. It's a beautiful room decor collage and I just think it's lovely. This is a couple of pages I set up for affirmations and my favorite quotes, but I never got around to completing them. And this is a couple pages of my favorite things, books, candles, cozy blankets, to name a few. This is a turmeric face mask I wanted to try. And of course, a little love, peace, positivity, and beauty from AI Brown Smile. This is my personal mission statement. Two thousand nineteen bucket list. 
a 52 week savings challenge. This is a great way to challenge yourself to save and track your progress throughout the entire year. This is my 2019 reading list and this is my list of 101 goals to be completed in 1001 days. Sounds crazy, right? Here's more DIY skincare using lemon and baking soda this time and some self-care inspiration. I also keep a cleaning schedule which helps me keep things tidy and organized around the house. A workout routine and I just thought these photos were pretty. This is July's gratitude log. I listed lazy days with my hubby, a house that feels like home and God's grace and mercy to name a few. As we get into August, I have a page where I save movie tickets from that year. And here's my number from a 5K I ran. So the months are a repeat of the same pages, basically. I also use blank pages for sticky notes and shopping list. This page was intended for a brain dump. October's gratitude included home cooked meals, self care Sunday, and the power of prayer. Can I get an amen? In November, I was grateful for being young, gifted, and black, okay? Parents who have my back and sweater weather. And finally, December. I use this journal to practice and play with different fonts and handwriting as well. Just something I enjoy. And that's it. 2019 was a great year. I married my best friend, returned to school to pursue my MBA, worked very hard towards my goals, and played hard. Thanks for watching, Smiley's. See you in the next one.